Hello everyone, my name is Nathan and today it's time for another episode of Let's Build a Car. Well, actually not. It's just an episode of my summer car because we have built our car. Now guys, I wanted to do a little bit of work in between the episodes. What I have in mind today takes approximately an hour or so if everything goes successful. Maybe actually a little bit more. However, oh my gosh, I attempted this about four times and every time I freaking failed by having a vehicle so madly turned over, especially the truck that I'm actually gonna grab right now. Man, this thing, I don't, I don't have it under control. It just flipped out while I was actually actually dragging a car. I don't know, I just wasn't able to freaking turn the truck anymore. So after 15 minutes of attempting that, I decided to just, you know, quit without saving and therefore I lost all the progress. So after the fourth time, I decided, screw this, screw this. What I actually did is I went into my cellar and I grabbed a old steering wheel that I had bought about eight years ago or so. So right now I have a steering wheel attached to my computer. I also already rebound all the keys, etc. So it should be working. Right now our truck is running, that's good. Let's test the steering wheel. Okay, nothing is happening. Oh jeez. Ah, of course, I have to enter driving mode. <laughs> I'm the noob. Okay, let's see. Yeah, look at that. Okay, the steering wheel is working. Then I can go into gears. That's fine. I have no idea what the key is for the handbrake, but we can do this manually. Oh, do I have a door opened? Why is this horning? Oh man, I don't understand trucks. Anyways, let's uh, throttle a little bit. Uh, ah, oh, okay, it's working. Let's go into gear one. There we go. And I can actually drive. <laughs> Okay, so maybe now I will be able to actually survive my endeavors, who knows? That's actually really cool. Okay, I should have done this before. How can I switch into high? Ah, there we go. Okay, I found the button. I knew I have set it somewhere. Oh jeez, I'm already, I'm already falling over. Whew. Okay, well, at least we made it to my building. So that is gonna be interesting. Maybe for the first time I will be able to survive this freaking adventure I have in mind. So what we have to do is we have to wait for a couple of phone calls so we do get a couple of jobs because we need monies, monies, monies. Also I need to take care of all of my needs but first of all I think we actually wait for the phone calls and maybe spray paint our vehicle. Let's actually light it up a little bit or maybe we can actually drive outside of the garage, yeah. What I want to do is I want to paint it in a nice black, at least to begin with. And then once we get ourselves a couple of upgrades going, we can do a more magnificent paint job. Let's see, I have to, yeah, yeah, there we go. Warm this up a little bit, beautiful. Now let's switch into reverse. Ah, okay, this is working fantastically. Oh, uh, the phone is ringing. I have to get this, get me out of here. Oh jeez. oh man, oh man, don't miss the phone. Ah, there we go, I'm here, I'm here. Ooh. Okay, so we have to suck some sewage and it's actually right here. That is convenient. I would like to have yet another job. That would be great. So in the meantime, we can actually, let's see, shut up the car and then we go ahead and grab some spray paint. Let's see, both of these seem to be black, but I want it to be with a little bit of reflection. Actually, while we are doing all of this, I would suggest we are already gonna start up the sauna because I'm gonna be on the road for a while and I will be dirty. So maybe we want to start this with a clean conscience. Good, the sauna is heating up. I'm already gonna take away the caps because we can actually paint these rims as well. And that's exactly what I'm gonna start with. Now, really, do not worry. We're gonna give this a nice paint job. Maybe you guys can actually suggest me some colors that you want to see this in. But for the time being, we're just painting the entire vehicle in black shiny black. Let's get rid of these caps as well. There's just a few parts to go. Got the door, fender and then the hood and I think that's everything. Great, okay, there's another phone call that is actually perfect because we are almost ready to actually go. Let's see. Another sewage job. Where is this one? Okay, they're actually right next to each other. Actually, we're probably gonna come from here, though. If we get another phone call, then this is probably gonna be another sewage job in Lopi or Lope or Lop. Yeah, let's just see for the time being. We're gonna fix this hubcap issue here. 
and then we might be able to prepare a letter actually. Since we are doing a couple of jobs, we should be able to purchase a couple of upgrades. What I want to go for first is what you suggested me right here in the catalog. We can switch to the gauges right there. So what I'm interested in is a couple of these guys because they tell me about the battery status and the oil status. I'm not sure what's in the middle. I will have to see when I get closer to it, but I cannot read this. But we're gonna still order one of that, 299, and then one of these air fuel gauges. That is gonna be good to better tune our car. Now that we have these two items, I think we can click this button. There we go, and we get an envelope. There we go, we just have to throw this down at the post office while we are on the road. So let's actually throw that letter in here. There we go, I want this here on the back. And uh, thinking, oh, look at that, we actually forgot to paint the trunk. I cannot leave this as such, no sir, that doesn't work out for me. So paint this, come on, come on, ah, so much better, look at that. We just have to fix the rust and everything, good. However, since we are already gonna go on the road, I think I'm just gonna fill up my tank here, my extra tank. Yeah, this bad boy. So let's go ahead and also throw this into the truck here, well, that could have gone better. Oh no, another phone call. Let's see where that is. Uh, hopefully it's somewhere sewage. Uh, yeah, sewage, sewage. And it's in Lope. Okay, I must not miss this turn. Let me get a little bit closer and see. Uh, so instead of going to the right here, I want to go to the left and then follow this. Oh man, this is a really long way to go. <laughs> oh man, uh, hopefully we are just gonna make it right here. That would be great because we are actually gonna pick up a vehicle in Lope. So that is gonna be the biggest challenge of them all. But let's do this. We want to get rid of our fatigue first of all, because I do suspect we will actually be waking up during the night again. Oh no, it's even worse. We woke up in the evening, so the shop is gonna be closing soon. It's gonna get dark. It's really bad. Let's go ahead and eat some sausage. Ah, interesting. So every time I actually did this for like four times, as I said, one sausage disappeared. So somehow they don't save them in the actual save game. So I can see how they are having problems setting up multiple save games. Anyways, let's uh, throw in a little bit of water here. I do believe the sauna, yeah, look at that, it's already heated up. So we can take care of our dirtiness, after that the thirst and urine, and then we just have to make it through the night somehow. Oh, I can actually take care of my thirst this way. <laughs> Why aren't you filling up? Because it's going next to it. Okay, makes sense. There we go, we want to pick that up and throw it in here. Beautiful, let's get ourselves as clean as possible. There we go, that is clean enough for my taste. Now what we can hope for is that we get tired enough to go to sleep once again and then it should be morning. But first of all, I have to take a little wee right there. Ah. Okay, the Wii is done. I don't think we are... Yeah, we're not tired enough just yet. We have to run around our apartment slightly in order to get tired. Look at that fatigue bar going right up. We can already sleep now and now it should be morning the next time we wake up. Okay, never mind. It is in the middle of the night. I will actually have to do this fatigue thing once more. But after that, we are ready. Actually, thinking about it, it is early in the morning. I mean, until we have made it all the way to the shop, it should be open, I think. So we can actually do this. Okay, I do believe we have everything required right now, okay? We have the canister, we have our envelope, and we have the truck that is required to suck up some sewage. So we are entering driving mode. There should be some lights. Yes, let's throw the engine on. It's giving up on me. Come on. Ah, there we go. Got it. Okay, I'm gonna get myself into a nice position and then I'm gonna switch to my steering wheel. Let's see. High one. Okay. Why aren't the lights working? I feel like... Ah, there we go. Okay. So far, so good. Now I should be able to switch into reverse much easier than with the keyboard. Ah, oh, man. This is so much better. Look at that. Oh, man. My windows are really dirty. Okay. Are you ready for this, guys? Hopefully, I'm not gonna flip around. I'm gonna be so mad if I flip around again. I wasted like four hours of my life accomplishing nothing holy cow but this already feels much much better i mean right now i can actually steer a vehicle without too much hassle i mean every time you press the keyboard it essentially steers all the way towards that direction it doesn't allow you to do you know fine adjustments and slowly going back into the straight position for instance so all we have to do right now is make our way to the first intersection and from there we're gonna go towards the left side. Ah, check this out, 70 with the truck on the gravel road. 
What else do you want? Well, I guess you want 100, but you're not gonna have that. You have to ask a Finnish person for that. Oh, jeez, I feel so secure. I shouldn't say that. I'm gonna jinx it. Whee! Look at that. We already reached the first intersection. It has never been like that. Okay, break, break, break. Gear down, and then we're gonna turn... Oh, holy cow, this thing turns much better than I thought. Great, okay. Let's make our way to Lope. Oh, 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 there's a turn. Yeah, oh, take it. Oh my gosh. Guys, you have no idea how scared I am. I don't want this to fail anymore. Oh, oh, okay, this is an intersection. Hmm. Do I have to go towards the left now? I think so, yeah. I'm such an idiot for not using this steering wheel earlier. I mean, look at the smoothness. I feel like a different person now. There's just the HTC headset missing now, and the immersion would be complete, and also the bar thing. Oh, 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 I think we can actually reach really high speeds here. Let's try to make it to 100. No, I shouldn't do that. I'm such an idiot. Let's try to get ourselves under control again. Wow, for the first time I can really enjoy this ride. This didn't feel long at all and I do believe we are already there. This must be Lope, right? Yeah, there we go. This is actually our new car. One of the cars you guys told me about that I can actually steal. And there's also our sewage job, guys. So I think the sewage thing is right over there. Well, I know it actually. I did it four times. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to steer my truck over there there somehow yeah 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 turn it stop and then reverse okay we want to go back and now i have to kind of look around a little bit and do it cool with just one arm ah there we go okay so i think huh no i'm not good i have to do this yeah 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 now it's straightening out towards the building and i think here at the bottom we can already see the sewage thing so it just disappeared behind my mirror there so we are gonna set the parking brake and then the hydraulic pump Good, okay. Ah, this feels great. Okay, I made it here at least. Now we can suck some sewage. Well, cover, you're gonna go there. Yeah, it's full. It's freaking full. Let's take the hose out and we're gonna grab this thing and put it in there. Hopefully we're actually close enough. Oh man, this is gonna make us dirty again, I guess. <laughs> but that's absolutely fine. Let's just throw the entire hose in there. Okay. Okay, great. So while this is doing its job, we're actually already gonna go over to the other car here and we're gonna line it up so that we can hook it up to the truck and actually tow it. So ignition, there we go, please turn on. Ah, this runs smoothly. Okay, that is nice. Uh, let's switch, no, not into reverse. No, I want to switch into D. Yeah, that is the drive, I guess. It drives automatically a little bit. Okay, let's uh, drive around the tree here, I guess. Hmm, I'm not sure if that was a smart idea. Okay, I, I think I want to switch into R right now and turn around. Yeah, okay, that's looking good right now. And stop and then go into D again. Great, and I just want to line myself up uh, roughly right there. So uh, let's actually go into neutral. And we are done with the search job. That was actually good timing. What we can do is grab our money first. Always grab your money first. You never know what happens with this guy. 1,200 mark. Great, we are also gonna pick this up and hopefully we will be able to get it out. Looks good, looks very good. There we go, we want to grab the end of it and put it somewhere close there in order to put it back. Okay, now the question is, do we have to align ourselves even better than that? And I believe it might be enough, actually. Let's see if it works like that. So we're gonna shut this thing off. It is in neutral gear, hopefully. It should be. And then we're gonna hook this up. Let's see. Toe, toe, toe. Where are you? Yeah, there we go. We got the toe right there and the other one right here. Come on, I saw it. Beautiful. Okay, those guys are now hooked up with each other. You want to do this as close as possible. Alright, so we are done with this place, I would say. And we're gonna hop into our truck again. Hydraulics, we want to shut them off. Why are you horning? I don't understand. Uh, anyways, let's just move. Let's just freaking move. And actually, let's observe a little bit what happens with the car in the back. Uh, seems to be good. Seems to be good. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, look at that. I think we can count this as a successful towing oh no it's not quite in the center <laughs> it's all right it's gonna be fine i'm not gonna worry about it anymore the only thing i'm gonna worry about is that we are not flipping over now of course we want to make our way to the second and third sucking location for the sewage oh geez oh geez ah man at least i can still feel that the car is attached to us 
so I don't really have to look in the back. Oh, jeez. Oh, no, don't flip. Oh, my gosh. I have to look. I have to... Okay, it's still good. It's still fine. Maybe we can actually improve that by putting our rear wheels down and give us more stability. Okay, I guess we kind of missed the turn. I'm totally surprised. Now we are at the main street, actually. So we're just going to take the main street. Why the heck not? Whew. Okay, I actually feel a lot safer right here. That's great. For the very first time, I'm hopeful we are not going to flip over. Ah, uh, this is not good. We are in sixth gear whilst towing a vessel. I'm getting too confident again. It's not good. Oh, guys, we drive 110 kilometers an hour with a freaking car at our... Oh, where is the car? Ah, there we go. <laughs> it's still there. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez. No, no. Ah, there we go. We finally arrived. We took a little detour over the main streets. It took a little longer distance-wise, but I think we could drive a lot faster. Oh, jeez, don't brake too harshly. We have a car at the back that doesn't brake. Okay, so what I think we're gonna do is actually refill these vehicles now, especially the truck. That is gonna give me a little break. I'm so freaking stressed out. And I also want to untow these guys, first of all, so that we can do the other two sewage jobs right off the bat. So I don't want this to be in the way. Get away. There we go. Okay, great. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna refuel this with a little bit of diesel. And from what I've heard, this is gonna take a while. So I'm gonna take a recording break. And once that's done, I'm gonna be right back. See you in a second. Okay, I took my break. I actually made myself a coffee uh, and it feels like this bar didn't go up at all. This is crazy. How much is this gonna cost me? This is insane. Holy Moses. Well, I think we're just gonna put the lid back on for the time being and I think I'm gonna do this off camera later on, but we want to fill this one up as well. You never know when you're gonna need it. Yeah, there we go. This is gonna take much less time. Good, we got a full canister. I'm gonna throw that into the back again. Oh, we actually have to grab our envelope. Good thing I see that. So what we want to do with this thing, I think we want to turn it like that. And then we can put it into the box right there. Uh, uh, ah, ah, okay, throw it in there. Okay, it disappeared from my hand, so that probably worked. Great, let's see, how much was that? 480. That's okay, that's absolutely okay. We want to purchase sausages, like, uh, you know, as much as we want. A lot, actually. All of them. Mm, maybe we actually buy some beer for the truck as well. And there we go, we are done. Yeah, just, just go right there. And then, of course, the beer goes right next to the driver. That just makes the most sense. Let's see, we have to suck some more sewage. There are two places that I know of, I do believe so. So we have to go uh, into this... Well, where do we have to... I think into this direction. Yeah, look at that. There's a guy waiting. That is mostly a good indication. I think I can even see the hole already. So do we approach this... Similarly as before, turn around right there, switch into reverse and then back. We have to watch the mirror, even though I have no idea how to interpret this. <laughs> it's too small. Okay, am I gonna drive over him? Holy cow. Oh, I, I can see the hole. We're just gonna drive towards the hole in the hopes of not killing anyone. Okay, yeah, that's what I suspected. This guy is almost in the way. I have to be careful. Okay, we go back back slightly and that should be a good distance right yeah we're just gonna do that he must be scared handbrake hydraulic pump and we're ready for the second sewage job we're making the big money well not really we're making the dirty money suck it up suck it up satana there we go that should be enough that should do the trick yeah Let's already have a look for the second sewage place. There must be one that is really close by to this. It could be over there. I think I can even see the guy. Yeah, it must be this one. Let's see, how full is our tank already? And where do we dump the stuff once it's full? Let's check this out. The tank is almost halfway full, actually. Ah, we are done. Give me the money. Another 1,200 well earned, I would say. Grab the hose and carefully walk out of there. Ah, oh, man, sometimes this is so annoying. Let's see. Lift it up and then move, move. Okay, there we go. We're gonna close this and of course we need to bring back the hose once again. There we go. Okay, we are done with this place. Let's go to the third sewage place. And then I have done my mission successfully, provided that we can make it back in one piece. All right, I think up there. Yeah, 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 I can see it. I can totally see this happening now. 
Great. Okay, we're gonna do this like professionals now. Drive up to here, switch into reverse, and then turn around. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we're gonna drive a little bit more backwards. That should be close enough, in my opinion. Handbrake, handbrake. Thank you. Hydraulic pump. And we are gonna do our third job. Amazing, guys. I really never made it this far. Mostly, I kind of ended up in the woods or somewhere on the streets with the towed car mushed up into the sewage tank. It was crazy. I would say we have deserved ourselves a beer. Yes. Mm. Ah, great. We are actually done. So we were close enough and we get another 1,200. Yes. Great. Look at that. 4,100 mark already. Feels great to make money, doesn't it? <laughs> If you don't get it out, sometimes it helps if you drive away a little bit with your truck. Also, if you ever lose this thing, you can actually just reload the game. If you save and reload, you will have it again. But now I don't know where the beginning is. This might be the beginning? Yes, okay, put that hose back. I'm glad everything worked out. Now we have to get back to our vehicle. I think you guys called that uh, a muscle car. We have to tow it again and we have to make it successfully back home. So we are far from a successful day still. Okay, we stop here and grab our muscle car. All right, let's do this. I want to turn around here. Hopefully I parked far enough. No, okay. This has a crappy turn angle, but we can deal with it. Okay, now we're gonna drive this all the way up to the freaking truck as close as we can. Okay, nice, 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 nice. That is as close as I can get it, I would say. Towing hook, yes, and towing hook here, please. Uh, sometimes this is so hard to find. Good, I got my car hooked up. We are ready to do our final drive. Let's just make sure. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of following us very closely, so that is good. Okay, I'm gonna risk it. Just drive into the road. Don't look left or right. Oh, oh, this guy. I know this guy is merciless. Oh, oh, I'm coming too fast. Oh, no. Oh, gosh. Is our car still alive in the back? Yeah, I think so. But it might be broken a little bit now. All right, I guess we are done with the nice roads, unfortunately. And this is where it could all end. I mean, so far so good. I'm feeling really safe with the steering wheel. Okay, this passage here could be a little bit critical because our car that we are towing could fall off the edge here. So I'm just gonna make... Yeah, look at that. It actually did. I just wanted to make sure that we have enough speed so we're not being pulled down. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, okay. D oh my gosh, I'm, I'm so nervous. The last intersection. Oh guys, I cannot tell you how much that means to me. Please don't give me up right now. Ah, Trautesheim Glückerlein. I can't tell you how happy I am to see this barn and these mailboxes. Finally, I made it here. Handbrake, there we go, so nothing goes wrong. We are gonna... Oh, we are actually totally fatigued, absolutely tired. However, we got... Oh, uh, yeah, we got our car here. <laughs> Not sure if that is the position I wanted to be in, to be honest. Just get out of there. Great. Okay. No, wait, wait, wait. Oh my gosh. Oh no. No, no, no. You don't. Oh god. Tree. Hold him. Hold him. Oh Jesus Christ. Great. Okay. We're gonna park this car right next to our minivan here. There we go. Put it into neutral. Wow. Oh my gosh. This was crazy. But we did it, guys. We just have to wait for the phone call that tells us our parts are here. Maybe before that was already him, but he's gonna phone you again, I guess. We take care of our needs and then I'm gonna wrap up this episode. Put this canister over there somewhere and then we're gonna grab our sausages and have a little sausage fest here. There we go. Oh my gosh, that's a lot. Hunger, take that. Fatigue, take that. Thank you so much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great time. And hopefully I'm going to catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.